Well, thankfully, um, we have censored all of the scandalous questions, so there's nothing too difficult to answer coming your way. Um, I would like to start out with a question from Robbie, who lives in District 5, and his question is actually for all of you, um, and he really wants to know how all of you got into the Hunger Games and what made you want to run for mayor in your respective district. So let's just quickly go down the list, and maybe you each can just say a couple of words about, you know, how you discovered the Hunger Games and, wh and why you decided to run for mayor. Um, Claudia, let's start with you. Okay, well, um, I discovered the Hunger Games because um, actually my older sister had to read them for school. But I took a look at them, and I thought they looked pretty interesting, so I started reading them, and I ended up, like, loving them. Um, I decided to run for mayor, though, because, like, I loved being able to talk to all the citizens of my district on Twitter and being able to share information, like, on what's going on in our district. Um, it was great, like, being a recruiter, but, like, I also wanted to be able to, like, talk to more people on Facebook. So um, I think that's mainly why. Okay, great. Um, District 2 Mayor Aldrin, what is your response to this question? Well, um, I, it was a lot of word of mouth um, with the books. I heard a lot of people talking about them. Um, and I always told myself that I would, you know, eventually get the book someday and read them, but it never happened. Um, but one time I was in my friend's room, and she actually had all three books um, on her desk. And, and the seeing them in person is what influenced me um, to go on Amazon and buy the whole trilogy. I took a risk with that one, but <laughs> with all the hype about it, um, I knew it probably wouldn't you know, be a bad decision. And I read all three of the books in record time. I don't think I've read any books so fast. Um, and with the whole mayor thing, I, I knew that this was going to be a pretty big thing. Um, we can already tell that this movie is one of the most anticipated things of next year. Um, and uh, knowing that, I I, I, always, I would want to be um, you know involved with it as much as I can, um, and I'm always on you know Facebook and Twitter. So um, the mayor jobs um, or the duties of the mayor sounded like it would be a lot of social media, which is what I like. So I thought this would be a great way to you know get to interact with fellow fans um, and just you know love the Hunger Games even more. Oh, very cool. Um, to speed things up a bit, I'm going to combine. Ellie from District 3, Nick from District 7, and Jen from District 8, because you all kind of ran for mayor together through Tumblr. Is that correct? And me. Uh, yes. Taylor from and District Taylor. And who else? Taylor. 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 <laughs> Taylor. Taylor. Taylor as well, yeah. Um, basically, Kayla, I believe, was the first one on Tumblr who had decided to run okay. for mayor for Ellie. District 9. <laughs> And um, she, she asked for help for campaigning, and I was just sitting there like, you know, what else can I do besides Tumblr and all these other projects? Why not try something with the capital PN? So that's how I got into running for mayor. And was it yeah, the same kind of thing same. For, for Ellie yeah. and Nick? Um, not for me, really. I saw that Jen and Ellie, who are my friends on Tumblr, they were campaigning a lot. And I was like, oh, that looks mildly interesting. But then later on, I was like, eh, it's been going on for a while now. Might as well enter. And then I entered sort of mid to late way in the race. And then with just, like, the huge support from Tumblr and everybody I follow and follow me, I just won. And it was amazing. And funny, funny enough, <laughs> um, we know the person who asked this question. Oh, really? Yeah, he he's our friend, and oh. <laughs> yeah, it's it's pretty like great. <laughs> well, that's, that's very cool, Ellie. Did you have anything you wanted to add before we moved on to someone else? Um, just that it, I don't know. It was um, great to campaign with a bunch of my friends. That was really it was really fun, and to have so much support from people. I thought, yeah, it was just real. It was really fun for me, and so thanks to everyone who helped us out. And I'm just really glad to be here. There's like a bunch of really awesome people. Awesome. Um, okay, so Hunter, you were the mayor of District Four. Um, how did you become interested in the Hunger Games, and why did you decide to run for mayor? 
Well, I discovered the Hunger Games in mid-2010 on uh, another fan site, and I was kind of reading the synopsis for it, and uh, I thought, oh, well, this looks interesting. And so I bought the book, and I read it in a very short amount of time, as everyone seems to do, and I uh, just fell in love with it and, and read the other books rather quickly as well. And um, I started the mayor race, I guess, about five or six days after it started. And um, I just sort of saw that it was... Uh... Anyway, I, I lost my train of thought there. Um, but, well, that, that's okay. Uh, it's okay. Um, it happens. Well, it happens. You, you won. That's all that matters. And I, <laughs> I want to mention this because I think everyone should know this. We can't talk about it. But I do want to let everyone know that Hunter was actually an extra in the movie. Um, but we really can't say anything more than that. Um, that's is, correct. What, what can we say about that? Um, well, basically, I was just selected to be an extra in District 12. And it was a really amazing experience. Um, and you should be able to see me in the film. Yay, that'll be uh, Hunter, really... Wait, Hunter, I have a question for you. Yes. What do you say to your detractors, your naysayers out there, who think that this little bit of information that's just been revealed could lead to an impeachment as mayor? <laughs> um, I, I'm not going to worry about that too much. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're fine. Con- as far as I'm concerned, like extras are perfectly acceptable for me, especially District 4 mayors. I think we can all agree that uh, you seem like a, a perfectly nice enough uh, fellow and, a, and a, a capable and competent leader. So uh, for those who, who think that there's a conflict of interest, which I've been seeing people saying, uh, let it go. Hunter is definitely viable as a candidate. And that's awesome that you were in the movie, too, by the way. On a side note, congratulations. <laughs> um, okay, so Gabby, we just need to hear from Gabby and Alice. And so, Gabby, just very quickly, why don't you tell us how you discovered the Hunger Games and why you decided to run for mayor of District 5? Yeah, sure. So um, back in June, I believe, I was working one day, had nothing to do, and my friend had read this book called The Hunger Games and was absolutely in love with it. So I picked it up for the Kindle and read the series within a week. Um, it was a new record for me personally. <laughs> um, as for Mayor, I wouldn't have run if it, if it weren't for the fact that I was selected as a recruiter back in, the, I think, end of September was when that started. Um, I got a lot of support from my recruiter friends throughout the race. Um, shout out to all of them. I believe Emil and Uli and Amy are listening right now. Um, and it's just been a crazy experience. I love all the support that we're getting, and it's just hanging on for the ride, I guess. Excellent. And last but certainly not least, District 10 Mayor Allison, um, same question from Robbie. What made you decide to run for mayor, and how did you stumble upon the Hunger Games? Um, well, I'm sorry I don't have more of an interesting story about how I found the series, but I just strolled into the bookstore, saw it, picked it up, read it within a couple of days, and then bought the other ones, read those, and I just fell in love with it. And I have the Capitol Twitter, um, the tweets sent to my phone whenever they tweet about it. So right when they tweeted the first time about the mayor, I got really excited. I was at work, and so I couldn't do anything until I got home. But I was really excited, and from right then I wanted to run and be mayor because I thought it would be really fun being a part of the fandom. Yeah, 